not guarantee you're going to hear anything, but we'll give it a try. Oh. Oh, turned off, I found something then as well. Try again. Right then, I don't know where that was. Channel 20 somewhere. In fact... We'll do it manually. love to know where this is. I've got a feeling that's on 433 550 so let me look on the um, hang on. See what sort of signal we've got on the commercial area. Four, three. There. So, uh, yeah. But, yeah, something like that would be ideal. Mind you, I, I just had a... You, cause I, I, when I was in August the other day, I picked up the Now, uh, bearing in mind, there's uh, 2.15 dBi gain, or 0 dBd, on the J-Pol. And there's a commercial aerial. Commercial aerial. So the aerial is working. Once again, there's the antenna. So, there you go. I hope that's enough information for you and I hope that's long enough. But uh, if you're interested in making uh, an external antenna for the PMR446, that, that should be... Uh, that was the one I have a go. There should be enough information there. I just want to get this to the station's um, signal report. Turn that one down.
Oh, my life. Talking about dead bodies on uh, on amateur radio now. But uh, for those who are wanting to know, it is 433-550, which is SU-20 on UHF. There you go. And the other t the other station just kicked in now. That's what his signal is. They're probably um, at a rail, we're speaking, so they were texting each other, trying to make up. I'll be surprised. He's got a better signal, as you can see on the, on the 2000. They're texting away on her phone, then she'll pick up the laptop and she'll be on Facebook. Uh, I just, I despair sometimes. Less noise beyond the, um, the signal on that one. A little bit more noise on this one. <laughs> so I suppose it gives me a, an opportunity in the evening not to have to sit with her. Well, nevertheless it works and works okay. And, um, I think that's it really. See you next time.